Hi guys, I'm Hera from Viewer the Marketing Team. In this video, I will do unboxing the latest product Viewer the D21 4K to show you what you get, and then go over the product in detail. So let's dive right in. This is Bureau D21 4K package. As you can see, it's very neat and simple design with a black sleeve. 4K images here and flip it over to the back. You can find some technical specs. Let's go ahead and open this up now. On the top, you have quick manual. And after moving it, you will find the main 4K dash cam. Inside a box, there are full HD real camera, hard wiring cable, Rear camera cable. Optionally, you can purchase 12 volt cigar power adapter. However, you cannot able to use parking mode, which we'll cover later. Okay, let's go over the product in detail. From 4K camera, Uses Sony Service 2 IMX678 8 megapixel image sensor. On the camera, you can see power and rear camera input on right side and micro SD card slot on left side. And four buttons on the bottom. This is power button. Press more than three seconds. Dashcam will be power on or off. Dashcam is starting. Loop recording starts. The first top is voice button. When press voice button once, you can change voice recording mode. Event voice recording starts. There are three different options such as voice recording on or off event voice recording, and parking voice recording. So, if you set as an event voice recording, your voice will not be included in your normal footage, but mic will be activated immediately when you got accident. So the sounds will be recorded for your event footage. Considering the privacy is very important, so I believe this function can be very helpful. If you wanted to toggle the voice guidance on or off, press voice button more than three seconds. Voice guidance off. This button right here is manual recording slash emergency recording button. When you press this button, Start manual recording. it goes back 10 seconds and Save a separate 30 seconds video file in manual recording event folder. Last one is Wi-Fi button. When you needed to access a smartphone app to download your video or to change the setting directly on a dash cam, press the Wi-Fi button to turn it on. Wi-Fi is turning on. And then go to the, your phone setting, Wi-Fi, find Vroid and enter password. After that, open app, then you can see that the app is connected with your dash cam. Flipping to the front, you can see the main camera, which can be rotated up or down to fit your car. And on the top, the built-in installation mounting point here. Next, rear camera. Rear camera uses Sony Service 1 image sensor 
at 1080p resolution. It rotated 360 degrees, so you can get any angles that you need. Hard wiring cable. You should install your dash cam with this cable for parking mode. Now, let's move on to the feature of D21 4K. 4K front camera and full HD rear camera records at 30 frames per second. Both camera HDR capable to give you better clarity not during the day but at night as well. Ultra license plate capture mode plus HDR supports identify vehicle license plates information even in very low light environment. D21 4K detects the pedestrian and beep the sounds. It works based on deep learning algorithm. D21 4K supports the dual band Wi-Fi 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. Fiorid also supports pairing smartphone via iOS and Android. Now, we are going to test how quick we can download one minute video file using 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz Wi-Fi with my iPhone 14 Pro. Are you guys ready? Start. As you can see, 5 GHz Wi-Fi is faster than 2.4 GHz. If you wanted to change your Wi-Fi band, you can change it in the setting. Vueroid supports the three parking modes, which includes motion detection, time lapse, and power saving mode. Motion detection. This mode starts 30 seconds recording when the motion is detected around the vehicle. If there is impact, event video will be saved in event folder. Time-lapse. Vueroid records one frame per second in time-lapse. If there is impact, it starts recording at 30 frames per second and put it into the event file. The most powerful feature of D21 4K is power saving mode when it draws very low current while parked. I will measure the current of dashcam by using multimeter now. Driving mode of D21 4K takes 430 milliamps of current. But when Bureauid goes into a sleep mode, it consumes 2 to 3 milliamps of a current. It means if there's nothing, no impact, no event, then it would last up to 200 times longer than driving mode. As we noted for parking modes, to work the dashcam does need to be installed with the supplied hardwire cable. I bring some questions what I got from my customers. First question, how to install the D21 4K on the windshield of Jeep Wrangler? Lens part can be tilted, cell mounted in on a windshield, then set your camera angle. Typically, Wrangler's windshield is almost upright. 
So when you install the D21 4K on the windshield, right here, and rotate it. So it will look like this. Second question, how many gigabyte micro SD card does D21 4K support? Fioroi D21 4K supports up to 256 gigabytes micro SD card. Third question, where can I buy D21 4K? Fioroi D21 4K is now available in Singapore, Hong Kong, Canada, and Australia. You can find more info on our website. This is the last question. What do you think the most advantage of D21 4K? I think the most advantage of D21 4K is power saving mode. I already mentioned before, D21 4K consumes two to three milliamps of a current when it goes into the sleep mode. It means D21 4K can be long last if there is no events or impact. It's even 4K resolution. And one more thing, you don't have to worry about the purchasing additional batteries since the current consumption of the dashcam itself is very low. Thank you for watching the video. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.